yeah, dude, that's what I'm talking about, man. <laughs> How long you been out and about? Uh, 2020. 2020. Summer of 2020. Summer of 2020. Fuck, recently. Were you just that bored in the house? How old are you? 20. You're 20? So you were, you, your birthday's this Wednesday? Happy birthday, man. Um, Guys gotta compete. Who sucks better day? That is, uh, you think so? He's got home field advantage. <laughs> All right, let's test it. Alex, get back out here. Alex, get back. <laughs> Are you single? You are single. It, you're gonna die that way if you want to be quiet. Anyway, you got any more room on your team? Because this shit is annoying. Oh. oh my god. So, no public boyfriend just yet. It's tough. What? He's not shit. He ain't shit. Why do you say that? Why do you, you... Don't cheer, you homophobes. <laughs> what, 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 made, what made him not shit? Besides you in there. Because yeah. <laughs> he was blocking the pet. Whatever, dude. Whatever. Whatever. You fucking turds. No, you were fucking turds, actually. <laughs> so stupid. Um, I'm sorry. Real question. Black dudes are the funniest people in the but. That's a black dude for sure. I know a black dude's laugh. That's all I did all of February. I just fell asleep. The black dude's laughing, man. Like, that was my ASMR. That brings me such joy. What's your name, bro? Uh, Tory, man. Who you here with? been more sure somebody's been a side chick in my life. <laughs> Black dudes answer you without even answering. They really do. Who are you here with? Ah. <laughs> What's that? I said we good. Ain't nobody's cameras out. You all right, man. You okay. <laughs> but don't start no shit, man, because I'll fucking boom. Got your ass. Boom. Got you on camera, Tori. Suspicious. Oh, man. I hope I get a side chick someday. Just go do all the things I'm not supposed to in public and shit. No side. One more time. No side, just the main. That's your main girl? Yeah, you felt the need to reiterate that? You felt the need. You're like, just to make sure. What's that? You almost got me in some shit. <laughs> You almost got you in some shit, man. Okay, this is your one and only girlfriend. No. Don't do that. Don't sit down. All right, sit down. Stop making this woman think the Tory fucked you. Okay, do not do that. Don't say that. No, you don't. You don't know who's sitting back there. Who's the girl you know? I know Brittany. You know Brittany? with Britney forever ago. Right? Next subject. Next subject. <laughs> what, you don't like talking about black history? <laughs> Chapter one, Britney. <laughs> you said everybody knows Britney? Yeah. Britney sounds like a hoe now. Everybody knows her. Hey, Tori, don't say that. <laughs> Has anybody ever seen a ghost? Yes, I have. I have back here. Hey, <laughs> there's six of us in here. I saw you. Me, 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 me,
I actually had a demon in my closet. <laughs> and, and the funny thing is, my ex-boyfriend sent it to my house after I broke up with him. Oh, <laughs> that's how you win a breakup. That's how, that's how you do that shit. He actually almost got into bed with her. Actually. It almost got into bed with her? I was, I was going to sleep. <laughs> Shh. <laughs> Spanish. <laughs> In Spanish. I thought I heard it going out, but then the covers behind me lifted up and dropped back down, and I couldn't. <laughs> you had a monster come to the foot of your bed. It was mumbling some kind of language you didn't understand, and then you thought it went away, and the covers beside you in bed lifted up and then let back down. You farted. Shut <laughs> up. Oh my God. Not Try. Ugh, smells like eggs in here. Must be a demon. <laughs> I think our house is haunted. Bro. <laughs> Do you hear that grumbling? Yeah, bitch, that's your guts. <laughs> you sick right now. <laughs> Backtrack. Hold on. How did your How did your ex send a demon to you? Okay, so oh. he was a very big like. He did like witchcraft stuff. He did witchcraft? This is already on you. <laughs> At what point in this relationship was he like, I'm a witch? <laughs> also, real quick, aren't males wizards? <laughs> yes. So he was a he was a wizard. You you he threatened to kill you. Why? Because I broke up with him. Valid. Well, I, well, I broke up with him. <laughs> A day before the year anniversary? Come on, but you couldn't have waited two more days? You couldn't have had the anniversary and then one day after be like, that was really fun, but... I feel like it would have been worse if I celebrated the year with him I don't think so. I think he probably had some shit planned, maybe a sacrifice for the, for the one... You don't look like a virgin. I don't think it was going to be... How was the dick, though? why you make a deal with the devil right there. Like, I'll sell my soul for just six, Lord. I swear to God. Please. <laughs> I've never seen a demon. I don't imagine. Have you seen an angel? Um, yes. I actually saw one. <laughs> I keep hitting you with shit that I'm like, this is the end of the conversation for sure. I just saw one too. Demon, I meant. I mean, a demon. That girl looks like she'll suck your soul out. <laughs> Just in case. Uh, there's also police officers here. I met a. Uh, Swindell. Officer Swindell. Did you meet Officer Swindell? Oh, is that his wife? That's his head. Oh, man. He said you take forever to come. He said that before the show. And he dared me that I wouldn't say it at the show. You seriously got to work on that. That's his trigger finger. And they really, like, he's got to... Oh, man. Now, he said you guys have great sex. He said he beats it up like you fit a description. He really does. He said sometimes he lets her wear the bulletproof vest and everything. <laughs> she's like, hey, well, bye. She puts on the bulletproof vest and then she's a teacher. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not one of your students. My bad. Sorry about that. <laughs> That's not even the last school shooting joke of the show. I lived in a crematory. You lived in a crematory? I, yeah. My old apartment was a crematory. Why do you know that? <laughs> Who the fuck just knows that statistic? <laughs> Nerd. And it's right next to a nursing home. It's right next to a nursing home? <laughs> the convenience. <laughs> Beth. Thank you.
there's a cemetery by the children's hospital? Come on, Pennsylvania. <laughs> Have a fucking heart, man. You do not put a cemetery next to a fucking children's hospital. You put it next to the school. <laughs> There was one more. I fucking told y'all, man. I didn't know where or how it was gonna go, but we fucking we found it. <laughs> All right, that's the last one, probably. It is last In what? <laughs> you're literally scraping food onto a plate while you're talking to me about sex. <laughs> You're enjoying yourself? Have you ever tried it quietly? <laughs> like meditation or... What's that? Your inability to please others. Oh, 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 my inability to please others. <laughs> oh, no, I could definitely make you come, for sure. <laughs> Who are you here with? Myself. By yourself? No. <laughs> Damn. You couldn't even get somebody to come with you. I'm a nice person, okay? You guys see I didn't start that? It doesn't finish it. It does finish it. I comedically, like, gave you a facial, dog. Like, I, I don't know how much better it can be. This is my security, in case any of y'all on your Will Smith shit right now. <laughs> like, getting offended, running up on stage. Keep my wife's name out your fucking hands. Cause yeah, never mind. Whatever. That's such a cool skill, man. This is like you solve an imaginary Rubik's cube. It's just killing shit. Is uh, anybody gay? Anybody at all? Vicinity. <laughs> I know you good with your hands, dog. Oh, I know it, dog. I know it. <laughs> this man will jerk you off with a poem. You're so sweet. I've just never been in this position before. This is so much fun. <laughs> oh, the sacrifice. The fuck? Did, did my interpreter just get gentrified? I don't understand. <laughs> who, um, who, who are you signing for? I didn't, I don't, I didn't even know. Um, I'm not sure. She said back there. <laughs> no, it is not you, bitch. You've been here on the whole show for sure. You make us wish we were all deaf, to be honest. Uh, you don't sound deaf at all. You said, this just seems so extra. What was your name? Nicole. Nicole. Great to meet you, Nicole. How did you, um, how did you hear about the show? Um, fuck. No, 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 no. Nice to meet you guys. This is so exciting. Thanks for coming. I just I just wanted to know. Yeah. Sounds like you don't need to be here, to be honest. Let's <laughs> yeah. so everybody be nice. Especially you feisty. I like your energy a lot. I'll come back there and take your fucking batteries out. I swear to God. <laughs> I swear to God. I'll turn, I'll turn you off. All right. Super Bowl. Gotta chill the fuck out, man. If I have her sign something, will you relay it verbally?
<laughs> you didn't know this was deaf comedy jam, did you? You didn't know. <laughs> What's that? It's for you. It's a Build-A-Bear. That's for me? Yeah. What is it? It's a Build-A-Bear. You got me a Build-A-Bear? Yeah. Why? It's a voice message too in it. It has a voice message? Yeah, from your show where you said if someone got you a Build-A-Bear. Oh my god. So I did, I did a TikTok one time where the girl in the audience was saying it was a red flag that a guy brought her a Build-A-Bear on a first date. <laughs> yeah. And I had said in the video, I was like, I would love if somebody brought me a Build-A-Bear. So you brought me one? Yeah. I gotta do more jokes about getting my dick sucked. <laughs> doing with all this cute shit oh god thanks i guess this is so sweet thank you oh your numbers are on here it might still happen it might still happen we can use them for cleanup can i take them out of here yeah this is so cute Aww. You didn't really, you didn't spring to get him any clothes? <laughs> That's kind of the whole, you didn't really build the bear. You just kind of, you kind of just, pst, looks like you stole one, kind of. There's a voice my one? Yeah, press his paw. Press the paw? What if I press it and it's just like, I want you to fuck both of us. It might be the other one. That sucks, I can't lie. That's, um, that's, uh, it's not incredibly audible, but it's a thought that counts. Thank you so much. This is, this is one of the, the sweetest, laziest gifts I've ever had. Thank you. Oh, back in there you go. There we go. But as we know, there's a reason you put up with crazy shit in a relationship, right? Pussy. Yeah.